Theorin the Corrupted decided to attack his own people as he was under control from the Grim of Wormtongue. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are here to end this civil war. And we are going to play Rohan against seven hard armies and every one of them is Rohan. On the beautiful map Old Brownlands, we are at the bottom left side and let's get it started. The free people of Rohan. This one is for you. This one is for death and glory. Holy moly, be aware guys, we're gonna see lots of ends in this one because we're gonna also build some ends ourselves. Two farms into the Hobbit Maria Dog Brandy Bog. That's the build order. And from the spell book, we don't need to go for the drafts. We will go for the heal. So early on, I would like to recruit as many heroes as we potentially can. It includes Theodin King, Eomer, the Horse Lord of Rohan, Eobin, the Shield Maiden of Rohan. We have also Gimli, son of Gloin, Legolas, son of Transwil, and Aragorn, the King Elessar himself. Let's capture this farm in the front side first, and then we're gonna move on to this one right after, and creep the Goblin Lair as soon as we potentially can to get a bit more money going. Now, of course, if you wanted to, we could also recruit some peasants from the farms, but I believe that's not really necessary, because we have only 80 available command points, as you can see and tell at the bottom left side of your screen, and I would not like to waste any of these command points for some weak peasants. And of course, we're gonna build one more farm inside the castle and start saving for heroes. I believe the first hero we're gonna save for is going to be uh, Legolas. I like Legolas a lot. And leveling up Legolas is kind of easy because he hits, he's pretty much hitting like a truck. He's like a one man army. And then we're gonna go for the three hunters. So Legolas, Gimli, and Aragorn side by side, just like in the films. But we need to build full farms first. Luckily, on an 8 player map like Old Brownlands, we are also getting faster resources than in, you know, in a map like Forts of Eisen, for example. The problem is that Legolas cost uh, 5 command points as well as Gimli and Aragorn. It means 80 or 15 out of 80 command points we have available has to be invested into the heroes. But fortunately for us, Theodin, Eomea, and Eowyn, they don't cost any command points. And they will be needed, by the way, especially Eomi and Theodin. We will need their leadership bonuses to make our Rohirrim Arches later on hit like a truck. And we will need to recruit many, many Rohirrim Arches to be able to deal with the ends. I'm invisible, boy. You can't see me. Oh. Oh, I couldn't get the last hit. But give me, give me the money. Give me the money. Hey, Rohirrim. I'm here. This Rohirrim, they are confused. They are like, what's going on? Some black magic. We are out here. <laughs> okay, luckily we get the money from the creep, which is needed. And also this spot is going to be safe for the well, for the sustain. And like mentioned before, we will need to recruit... Oh, he one-shot us. Now, I really hope that he won't kill these farms and build the end mode already. That would be the worst case scenario, trust me. We are not ready to deal with ends just yet. But we will have a one-man army beside Legolas too, and that's of course Aragorn, Aragorn, Araton's son. Aragorn with Anduril's sword and Bleedmaster. Holy guacamole, guys. This guy is gonna be unkillable, you know? He's not only the tankiest hero, but also he has the highest DPS in the game. Then he has the Bleedmaster activated, and he has the Anduril sword from the Spellbook of Rohan. He will be pretty much unkillable. He can even kill those ends in like two shots. I represent the and it's of course gonna be our next hero. Now I would like to build a Posan gate because opening the gate is always kind of questionable. Let's move on. And also what we need to do, hold on a second, we need to revive the you know the Hobbit and put him on one of the one of the settlements to make him invisible. This way we can make sure that the enemy is not gonna be able to build a end mood on this spot. Let's move on. So Legolas, they have healed from the spellbook in the worst case scenario, and there come some peasants, but it's okay. Because Legolas is of course gonna take care of these. No problemo. Ah, Rohirrim, they think they can deal with me? Pew! Hawk strike. Twin arrows, my friend. Twin arrows. Oh, more peasants are coming all the time. But it's fine. Legolas hitting like an absolute track. And we are gonna save for uh, Seeds. We are gonna save for Aragorn next. But of course, we will need to get draft from the spellbook. Look how many units he has on the field. What is this fiesta, my dude? Just peel back. Let's go now. We can't deal with all of them at the same time. That's not possible. So let's fight around the postan gate because in the worst case scenario, we can just enter that. And we also need to get the draft from the spellbook. 
Okay, let's go inside. Let's not risk the biscuit. There are lots of peasants and yeoman archers. The farm is gonna be under attack, but it's fine. Because he can't build the end mood right now. We are cash floating. Aragorn next. And Gimli last from the three hunters. I'm over here. Follow me. Follow me. So let's go out. Um, you know what? We need to build a tower here. And luckily, like mentioned before, he's not able to buy this. You! Oh, that was a hardcore hit, boy. Son of Arathorn, come, join. Join Lego Das. We need a bit more than one power point to get Anduril's sword unlocked. And once this is gonna happen, Aragorn is gonna be like a one-man army, boys. Trust me. We have also Atelas. Let's use it to heal up Legolas a bit. And we will save now for... Let's actually save for Eomir first. And the reason for that is Eomir, besides having insane amount of damage leadership for the nearby Rohirrim and Rohirrim Arches, also gives us the Outlaw leadership, which means money, money... Oh! What was killing him so fast? Holy! He was almost getting killed in a single shot. It was kind of dangerous. I mean, not even close, baby. Calculate it, Kappa Kipo. Eomir, hey, Legolas, please assist your friend Aragorn. Now, let's use Bleedmaster to make him tank here. And look at the power points are rising now. We gotta put Eomir next to Legolas. This way we can passively gain uh, experience points. And you see that? And he needs to be level 2 for the Outlaw leadership, which means money, money, money every time we kill enemy units. And Aragorn, of course, hitting like a truck. Especially when Bleedmaster is active. But when Bleedmaster is on cooldown, we gotta be careful. Because we have Atelas, the sustain from Aragorn himself. But also the heal from the Spellbook of Rohan, still on cooldown. Okay, level 2 almost unlocked. So let's peel back. Let's beat them into the range of Legolas. And we have almost the money for Gimli too. And after Gimli, we will need to build Armory first. Before we recruit any units. Okay, level 2 unlocked. It's beautiful. You see now, we get plus 7 for killing each of these peasants. And the money is more... We will get more money from killing stronger units like Rohirrim, for example. Or heroes or ants. We will grow rich from the outlaw leadership of Eomir. Trust me. Okay, let's go for the Gimli next. And same here with Gimli. We can put him next to Legolas. And this way, he can passively level up over time. And he's not able to build the end mode because of, because of our hobbits. As he's being stealthed around this area. Look, he can't buy this one. But even if he does, I believe he should be fine. Let's demolish the well for now. Because we will, I would like to keep the farms for now. Gimli is on the field, the son of Klein. And let's put him on the left side of Legolas. And look at that. He's almost level 4. That's going to unlock his Horse Lord leadership for 60% more damage and 50% more combat experience for the nearby allied Rohirrim and Rohirrim archers. Hey, Legolas, please shoot. Okay. And Gimli has to be level um, 3 for the leap attack and level 7 for the Slayer. Slayer is going to make him move quite fast. Other than that, Gimli is the slowest hero. I mean, it's kind of obvious because he's a dwarven hero at the end of the day. So he's not meant to be fast. Let's buy all the upgrades from the armory and put these heroes next to Legolas. Very important. I mean, Eomir doesn't really matter anymore because he has already unlocked everything. But Gimli has to still get some experience points. And the good thing about this situation for us is, until Rohan is able to kill one of the settlements, he's not going to be able to build a end mood anytime soon. That still only counts as one. Pew! Gimli versus Gimli. And that's what I'm talking about. The Rohan Civil War, boys. They will not get past me. Oh, but Legolas is hitting like a truck. Level 3 unlocked. It's beautiful. We have now leap attack in the worst case scenario. We just need to make sure that Eomir is nearby. Just to be able to get money from killing those peasants with our Eomir. With our Legolas, I mean, sorry. Wait for the armory to be finished. And once the armory finished with all the upgrades, we can demolish that and build the archer range to be able to get the Firestone or Fire Arrow upgrade, rather. Purchased from the archery range level 2. Okay, we are also being attacked on this farm, but it's okay. We can now make a move. So, let's group all the melee heroes like Aragorn, Gimli, and Eomir in number 2 and Legolas in number 1. The heavy armor is ready. That's nice to hear. Oh, there is Legolas. Let's see who's who has the stronger Legolas. Erowen, look at this. Pew, 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 pew. We get 145 for killing Legolas, guys. 
Like I'm telling you, the uh, outlook, he has more Lego lessons, of course. That is still in, King. Poor King, what can he do against such a reckless seed? He already the corrupted, but unfortunately, we get only 45 for killing him. <laughs> but it's okay, though. This Legolas has no chance. Oh, we lost the... Uh, we lost... Wait, hold on a second. Is he gonna build the end mutter? Let's hope that this is not gonna be the case. We need to go to the spot before he builds the end mood. Very important. The armory is finished. Please, please, don't, 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 don't. Don't build the end mutter. Oh, they're fast, 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 fast. Oh my goodness, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, what? What happened there? That's kind of questionable what happened there. What is, what is going on? What? They have also healed from the spell, but I'm not worried. Let's use the... Arrowwind. Let's use Plate Master. And let's use also Leap Attack. Here's Aragorn too. But it's okay. Our heroes are highly leveled, you know? Now our goal is to get Eomir, uh, I mean Aragorn to level 10. Which is gonna unlock the off breakers. Okay, we are winning those fights, no problemo. We have almost the power points also for... Oh, wait. I'm actually kind of sloppy. We should be building this archer range long time already. And also need to revive Elmia. I mean, Meriadoc Brandywalk once again. For the same situation like I explained at the beginning of the video. Just to be cloaked around this area. Elmia, what you doing, bro? Heart army. We get so much value, I'm telling you, boys. We get so much value from the outlaw leadership from Elmia. That's kind of insane. Like, I wish there would be some, you know, endgame information about the abilities from the heroes. To see how much damage they were able to deal or how much money they collect for us, you know. And if this would be the case, I would, I can guarantee you that Elmiam is all alone able to get over a, over 10 or maybe even 20,000 resources collected. Through the entire game. Legolas is level 10. Gimli has been taken down. And also, Aragorn is level 9 already. That's pretty nice. Meriadoc Brandybok, come here, my friends. Come here. Oh, there is Legolas. Cloak. Let's use Attila. Oh! What is killing my Legolas that fast? The Elven Warriors, though. Let's kill Legolas from him. Okay, he has even some armor and stuff on his peasants. Kill him, Legolas. Use Hawk Strike. He has no uh, Anduril Sword. It means Legolas is going to be faster than him. Look, look this. Pew! <laughs> 225 in the bank. We have almost the army of the dead with heroes all alone. That's crazy. Archer range level 2. Let's go for the fire arrow upgrade on our Rohirrim archers later on. And our heroes are pretty much like a one-man army now. And you know what we can do? We can build the end mode now by, by ourselves. That's what we can do. And with the end mood, we can break through the wall of this Rohan and get inside the genes with our Rohirrim and Rohirrim archers. And I believe we can even end this castle from Rohan with our heroes all alone. Let's actually make... Let's actually make an end army, guys, shall we? I'm gonna build this table regardless, but I wanna make an end army. We're gonna suicide with this Yeoman archers, we don't need them. They are a waste of command points. And I wanna make an end army, boys. Oh, I think that's a great idea. Let's recruit three beard and bunch of ants. So now they will have the feeling about that. How it feels like. Let's give them also fire arrow. Just why not? Hey, don't. But I believe killing this farm is kind of pointless. So don't kill the farm. I'm telling you. Intmur is finished. That's dope. Let's recruit uh, three beard. And also a couple of ants. And let's go and destroy the wall, shall we? And you, my friend, Meriadoc Brandybok, don't kill the farm. Don't, 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 don't. That's gonna hurt us more than them, trust me on that one. Look, Elvin is trying to kill our ants, but no, 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 no. Oh, he has Legolas there, but it's okay. Let's cloak Meriadoc here. Aragorn has been taken down. We have 10 power points collected for the army of the dead, but I think that's not needed for now. We don't need that. There's also Legolas there. Where is Legolas from us? Uh, let's use Atelas. Our ends are gonna be gone very soon. Okay, let's kill the sitter. Get more ends on the field. Oh, did, hey, 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 Eomir. Don't lose Elmia. I need to use heal potentially. 
Do I need to use heal? I, f I have to, yeah, I have to. Let's peel back now, because the ends are gonna be gone very soon. And after the ends are gone, the towers are gonna start shooting us, you know? That's why. They have it's okay, it's okay. I am over here. Um, you might also go for the Alvin Wood to be able to summon even more ends later on from the Spellbook of Rohan. For now, we have four ends, including Tribier, of course. Filthy beast. More units are coming from this area, but it's okay. We don't really need to be worried. Um, the thing is, we have heal on cooldown. That means we need to be careful. Let the ants tank the arrows. Ants are almost invincible against anything but heroes or fire. They can tank these arrows forever, trust me. Especially with Treebeard, because Treebeard gives you also 50% armor. So let's go inside the jeans. Eomia, just stay close to Legolas. That's all you gotta do. Don't need to do anything else. Uh, Aragorn, you are level 10. That's dope. Let's tank. You can, you see that, right? The ends are so extremely tanky that they can just tank all these arrows for this. A fine hit. A fine hit. A fine hit. Go inside the jeans too. If also heal uh, from Aragorn. I believe the Aragorn heal should be also working on, say it. Uh, on the on the three bit maybe I don't know because three bit is also a hero uh, but I can't confirm I've never tried it before. Oh he has fire now right? Oh yeah he has fire now we gotta kill those now. A fine hit. So Aragorn, come to get up my friends and let's use Antelas to heal up Legolas and Ar um, Elmia. One of the ants is burning but it's okay not the end of the world. Make more ends in the meantime. They will not get Actually, not because we will not have the money we need to buy this beast. Then, ends are extremely expensive units. And this castle, ladies and gentlemen, has been destroyed. Now, we gotta make sure to buy these structures and not not lose don't lose this farm. We need to buy this before he buys that. You know. Actually, let's build the end mood here too. And I think about that. I sense evil may be near. So, I mean, I believe we don't even need to recruit any any units anytime soon. So let's go for the attack immediately. We have almost the end power points from the spellbook too. That's crazy. Guys, we will have at the end of the game, we will have like thousands of ends. Trust me on that one. Okay, we buy this base, that's great. The farm is under attack, but it's okay. Legolas needs ages because arrows are not dealing any damage to the buildings unless they have fire, which is not the case for heroes like Legolas, of course. It's not possible. Let's make more farms because we will need money to be able to spam ants all the time. Yeah, attack the ants. Come on. I dare you. The only weakness of the ants is that they are extremely slow, you know? Just ignore the peasants, no problemo. We don't need to really need to be worried about them. There is one peasant in our base, right? Yeah, but it's okay. Let's build one tower on each side and we are good to go. Now we need to attack the guy at the bottom right side. Very important. Close the gate. Oh, my tower didn't go off, but it's okay. Our heroes are under attack, but it's okay. The peasants, they can't kill them that easily. He's towering up, but of course, like mentioned many, many times, that doesn't really matter anything. Where are all the where are the other ends, though? Well, they are coming, but they are so slow. Holy moly. Kill these towers. Mary from the Shire has been taken down. How? This Lego is actually quite annoying, but he's gonna die to this anyway. A fine hit. Let's group all together. Okay, now we can go inside the jeans. Prepare yourselves. Okay. 
They're almost gone, but Treebeard is going to be still alive. Oh, we need to use heal for Legolas, though. He's quite low. Legolas hitting like a truck, boys. Fight for me! Fight for me, and I will hold your oaths fulfilled. You heard him, boys. You heard the king. Hey, Gimli. Oh, wait. Gimli, would you mind to use your Slayer to deal more damage to the buildings? And Aragorn, you're gonna do the same, of course, with your Blade Master. What is happening in the meantime here? Oh, Aragorn is actually killing our ends, right? Let's see, Aragorn against the end. But he has no Bleed uh, Undoing Sword. But still, you know, Aragorn is, of course, extremely strong hero. We need... We, ca we need to be careful. Because our Hobbit is dead. And the farm has been taken down. There is a high chance that he might build a end mode there. Which is not very good for us if this is going to be the case. I want to still recruit some... Um, Rohirrim Arches, though, before anything else, because I like them. They are my, they are, they are, you know, alongside with the ranges from the Gondor faction, they are my second favorite, most favorite unit in the game. Don't build end mode. Of course, you're going to build the end mode. <laughs> but it's okay, let's get with the heroes here. We have time until it's hitting 100%. Aragorn is coming, Gimli is coming. We have Theoden now on the field, the king of Rohan. Let's build some more towers here. Yeah? But we need to, of course, buy this one as well. Three beards now, you gotta move on. Okay. So our heroes, you need to move now as soon as possible to the spot. Because with Aragorn's help and Gimli, we can kill those ends in no time. Let's close the gate. Or oh, Gimli! Why didn't you move, Gimli? We need you. Look, Gimli is so slow now. We need to use Slayer to make him a bit faster. Mary has been taken down once again. There comes the end summon from the open end. It's okay, though. Protect. Buy this farm. And buy this farm. Tribute you to protect this area with the help of this end, too. Let's buy full farms inside the base, too. And we gotta, we gotta care about our heroes. Kill Aragorn. Aragorn, you go now inside the jeans, my friend. Blade Master. Now I will show you guys the power of Aragorn. Watch this. Look this. <laughs> Crazy, am I right or not? Look at this damage. What is this damage, boys? I mean, they are also, of course, they are able to damage him, but again, none, none other hero can do that. Ever. But the problem is, he's summoning more and more ends at the same time. Oh, we gotta be careful. Let's not lose Aragorn. Don't fall behind. Aragorn, we gotta kill this end mode before more ends are getting summoned, my friend. Aragorn killed this end mode, yeah. He was able to break. Don't lo lose the heroes. Kill this end and revive or revive Meriadoc Brandybuck. We are able to defend here. Let's close the, uh, the gate regardless. Let's fill up the base with additional farms. We have full farms also around this side. Let's get some more ends on the field, too. And now what we gotta do is we need to attack this dude. We need to attack this dude. And for that reason, let's bring some Rokirim Arches. Because, of course, the, the ends are not bad, but they are also extremely slow, you know? So let's get all the power points from the spellbook. Everything is now unlocked. Let's summon the Alvin allies here. So basically, let's give them number two. Eomir, my friend, you need to get mounted. And Theoden is mounted already. That's beautiful. Okay. So, oh, Treebeard is getting some serious damage. But now, without Bleed Master and without Anduris, what you can see, Treebeard is slapping him. <laughs> ah, yeah, exactly, my friend. Let's build another end mode here. Just to feel a bit more safe. Let's send Tribute back to the base, maybe. I think that's the best bet. And if you don't know, the well from Rohan is able to heal up the Tribute, too. Even though he doesn't need that, he can be healed um, over time, as he's a hero, you know? Alright, so let's go. Because now we can just summon the ends and go for this base right on the left side. That's the goal. There they are. But they have no chance. Hey, Elmia. Oh my goodness, what is that? 
Are I gone? Are I gone? We had to use Atilas. Was really close. There, there is Legolas somewhere. He's able to shoot over the wall, by the way. What the heck is that? Okay. And there comes Aragorn from him. Oh, Legolas is actually coming with the... With the <laughs> uh, say it, the knife fighter. But he's flying now. Flying now. Fly now. If have ends mood. We are command points capped, unfortunately. We are not able to recruit any more units yet. You can also use three notches on the Rohirrim notches, by the way, if you don't know. And now we can go inside the jeans. There is always hope, as Aragorn would like to see. Summon the small army after that. And summon, uh, use also the, uh, the Slayer from this dude. Legolas has to be careful, though. Legolas is in a... Oh, Legolas. Legolas, run! Run, my friend. Don't get body blocked, I'm telling you. Well, Legolas has been taken down, just like that. Oh. Oh, that's bad. Let's revive him, though. Keep up the pressure from this side. We have now three beasts. Of course, it's hard to defend every single one of them at the same time. But it's okay. Now, Rohirrim, go inside, my friends. Oh, three... Oh, 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 be careful. King of Rohan. Oh, it was too late. Couldn't lag. Couldn't heal fast enough. Alright, we gotta peel back, though. We lost a lot. We might even lose our Aragorn, maybe. And Gimli. Yeah, I think that's gonna be the case. Do we have Atelas? Yeah, we have Atelas. The buildings are just too tanky for us to deal now. To deal with. We could always summon the army after that, but I'm trying to get away without summoning them, you know? We need to definitely get some more Rohirrim archers on the field. And hopefully, we will be able to run away from this situation. Leap attack to close the gap. Gap. Aha! And run, you fools. Fly, you fools. I mean... Okay, um, yeah, we lost a lot. We actually lost quite a lot, guys. If Ant's doing absolutely nothing here, just reinforce his troops. Gimli, can you get away? I think you should be able to, Gimli. We also lost the gate, right? Yeah, it's okay, though. Okay, uh, we have to build a well for the sustain. Did we lose all the Rohirrim arches, too? Yeah, we did. Oh, man. And more Ants are coming, ladies and gentlemen. But Gimli was able to get away, that's good. They will come now. But they have also ends, no problem, alright? Okay, and more ends are coming from this side now, that's good. Get invisible, Marriott, Brandybok, Legolas, wait. So let's group this units. The three hunters under the banner of number three. And we will have Rokina Majas under the banner of number one. And our Rohan heroes like Elmi and Theorin under two. But first, the king has to be mounted. And also, Theorin has to get level four ASCP for a glorious charge, for death and glory. Uh, but we are command points capped once again. But it's okay. We can in the meantime get the horseman shield. Not that, it, that we need time because you can't buy them on the Rohirrim arches. That's only possible on Rohirrim warriors. What we can always do is you can, again, use the um, train archers on the allied Rohirrim archers too. The trees are awaking. Just attack everything. Let's summon the elven warriors too. And there come the Ents army, but it's okay. I think they're gonna die in no time. Aragorn can also be a bit closer. Aragorn gives also leadership, by the way, if you don't know. And once again, Ents' biggest weakness is fire. And Rohirrim archers are also mobile as hell, which makes them hit like an absolute drag. They are gonna raid. Oh, but what is this? Oh man! More ants are coming, but one of the Rohirrim archers got actually bugged. He was entering the wall for whatever reason. Theorian, you need to stay closer. To the units to level up a bit faster. Look, these ends are burning like crazy, boys. What is happening in the meantime? Do we need to? Uh, did we lose three beards? I think we did. 
Yeah, we lost three beards, but it's okay now. Now this unit is kind of useless, guys. We can't do anything with him. Uh, you know what? We can summon this small army of the dead from Aragorn. Awaken army of the dead to kill this end mood because end moods are pain in the ass. You know, they are really painful, guys. Is this tribute? Yeah, it was tribute. <laughs> Hey, don't kill. Look how many ants he's getting in no time. Let's kill everything. Aragorn, stay closer. Alright, beautiful. So we killed that. But we are not able to get inside the jeans yet. We will need to wait for, the, for, the, for our end summon, actually. Tribit is here. Looks like we were not able to deal the damage I was hoping for, but it's okay. Hopefully we won't lose this one. We need to make sure to protect this area before we even have to deal with more ants. That would be really not wise, my friends. Oh, I Dude! We need to kill the Entmode Aragorn, Aragorn son. And kill those ends one by one. Tyrion is level 4. Aragorn. Use Atelas. Kill this last end before Aragorn dies. Now we can summon our own ends. Let's use heal here to give sustain. Send the ends in first. This way they can tank all the damage. And then we're gonna follow up with our units. Because there are so many... Uh, you know... <laughs> Towers and stuff like that shooting us down. And our units are quite vulnerable against this kind of stuff. So we need to be careful until the ants are the ones who are tanking all the damage and we go inside the jeans and focus down the buildings only. What is happening in the meantime? Oh, we lost. He has Aragorn with Anduri's ward. Let's close the gate here. He killed the tree beard and he's building now ant moods. And that's what I was afraid of, guys. But it's okay, we need to finish this guy now ASAP. Gimli, you need to use Slayer. And kill this Aragorn. Before he kills even more ants. Gimli, where is, where is Gimli? Okay, Gimli, Gimli is slapping. Aragorn, go, go, go. Let's move on. We are getting bullied by the towers, that's what I was talking about. Let's not lose the level 10 Rohir Macha. Would be a shame. Did we lose this end mood actually? Yeah, we lost the end mood. We might build another end mood here. Yeah, I knew it. Holy quacamole. I'm telling you guys, that's kind of triggering. Kill this last building, please, before you go down end. Yeah, he's using the Bleed Master. Uh, I mean, the LN deal. Hard Army has been defeated, though. That's good. Yeah, even though we are playing smart, slow, and stuff like that, but it's still, you know, you can see and tell, oh, he's getting inside the jeans. He, did he already break the gates? Yeah, he did already break the gates. Holy moly, man. Okay, build towers. I mean, towers are kind of useless, guys. Not gonna lie against er against ants, because ants are so tanky against arrows, you know? So we might be forced to use the EOD, but I'm trying to win without using it one time. I, I don't want to use it. Alright, so let's go out. I hear I even hear more ants by the way. And what can men do against such a reckless seed? Oh, and more ants. Oh Gondor? So this has been taken down. Well, well, well. Aragorn just killed the ant mood. That's all I'm asking you for. Uh, let's close the gates here. Help me. They are gone the from city this will not fall. Ha, fire. Gimli. Okay, we kill it. That's good. Now we gotta build our own end. Do, do you guys hear that? <laughs> do you guys hear that? What is this fiesta, my dude? He has also end mood in the front of, of us. So let's build our end, own end mood. Let's defend this base first. This base is in a kind of good spot. But that's all about it. We will lose this entire castle, I believe, in long terms. We gotta move now. Oh, 
For death and glory. This is gone already. Nice, he destroyed it once again. More ants, boys. Just why not? We need more Rohir marches too. But one of us, one of our Rohir marches, kind of trapped, you know. Okay, let's build our own. Let's defend this area first. Rohan must end. And also, this base is falling apart, and I hear just more ants crying all the time. Okay, we don't 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 lose Aragon. Luckily, our ants are hitting very hard. Pressure. And this base is gonna fall, guys. I think. I think. Our heroes need to be stay, staying closer to make this Rohir match a bit stronger. Let's go inside. Uh, but I believe it's gonna be too late. Look how many ants he has. This is also in a bad spot. Aragorn, you need to stay also closer. He has too many ants, boys. He has too many. Hey, don't run into them, maybe. Tribute, you think you can handle the situation, my friend? Trust me, you can't. But fortunately for you, I hear even more ants crying all the time. Let's buy this piece. Get out. Now we gotta move on and destroy this end mood behind us. Let's build towers here first. Let's close the gate. I mean, we don't need farms. I know what you're saying, but you can never have enough money. You know what I'm saying? Okay, we shouldn't build this, by the way. But it's okay. Uh, let's come here. Wait, uh, let's build more farms. And second well. For the max sustain. There they are. But the challenge is, of course, hard. No army of the dead. I mean, at least not the big one. We have, I know we have used a couple of times from Aragorn. But it's only one battalion. You know, it's nothing like the big one. The big one is, of course, the MVP one, you know? Also, we, I think we broke through the gates. Yeah, so we can also go inside this base later on. But we need to make sure that Aragorn is going inside first because Aragorn is tankier than Rohir marches. We need to destroy this. Hey, this is the enemy. Okay, more ants are coming. Oh, 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 oh! Aragorn. Hey, guys, heroes, you need to stay close to the Rohir marches. Look the burst damage from Rohirrim Arches, though. Oh my goodness, man. That's such a crazy damage, dude. Legolas, you defend this area. Give me this tanky boy. Oh, remember when I, when I said, give me this tanky boy. He dies in a second. Let's not use heal because we don't need that. More ends I can, I can hear. And I think he will be also summoning ends there. Oh, that's our ends, actually. That's pretty good. Let's go. Let's heal up over time. And also, let's try to not give him the end mood here. Let's build our own end, own end mood. Okay, we close the gate. That's good. Let's build full towers for more safety Okay, let's heal up our time a little bit. And once again, we have a level 5 Rohirrim Archer doing absolutely nothing. And let's go now for this piece. Ants are extremely slow units, but it's okay. We can just summon them to make sure that they are face tanking the towers. That's the entire premise of that, actually. And we need to wait until Aragorn is leading the army to victory. Legolas. And also, really important to mention is the fact that Rohirrim Archers are also quite strong against heroes. I mean, they are... They are only weak against, like, they are kind of glass cannon units. But when it comes to ditch damage, they are crazy. They are also quite mobile, since they are calf at the end of the day. They are just, like, crazy strong, you know? Go, go, go. Aragorn, you go inside the fir inside the base first. Actually, you know what? I think we can risk the biscuit. Because we have, of course, Glorious Charge. So, Theorin, use Glorious Charge. Go inside. Okay, just wanted everything. You see our damage output? That's kind of crazy, am I right? 
But once the glorious charge is off, it's gonna be a different story. That's why we gotta kill those stuff, kill these buildings ASAP. Let's use heal. Keep our heroes next. Oh, we are losing a lot of Rohirrim arches, guys. Break the gate. Okay, we defeated him, but if we lose all the Rohirrim arches, we, we saved one. Barely. That's why they are so weak against arrows. Let's buy this piece, but we defeated him. That's all it that matters, really. That's pretty good. Do we have ants here? Yeah, we have three beards. Let's build do do? double well for the double sustain. More farms and, of course, towers. But it's still in it. It here. Keep these lands safe. Right for Rohan. We have the new, have the new farm. The farm is right. What you doing, bro? <laughs> he lost his way, you know? Oh, look. Now we have... Okay, now we are talking. Because now we have also more command points available. That's great. Fight for Rohan. Fight for Rohan. Standing ready with the flag of Rohan. Alright, so we have now in total four or five battalions of Rohirrim matches, guys. That's a different story. And I even hear more ants. I don't know where they're coming from, though, I can tell. Let's go. Let's kill these. Let's close the gate regardless. More ants also. Money is no problem right now. Oh, there is an ant mood coming up. Okay, I see you. Oh, there is also an ant mood coming up. It's okay. It's full strength. More Rohir Margers! Okay, you guys go now. We broke the gate. That's great. Now we are talking. Keep the heroes closer. To so the Rohirrim Arches, because leadership is the key to victory, guys. Just kill these ants in no time. Let's fight. 4v4 versus 2. Ends, ends war. The end game. Hey, close, closer to the Rohir matches Aragorn. Especially Aragorn, by the way, because Aragorn gives you also damage leadership. We gotta kill this. In the meantime, we are also trying to go. But look, this Aragorn is also smashing us. Aragorn, Legolas. Slap him, Treebeard. Slap him, Treebeard, and end. I'm, I'm counting on you. Shall remember this day. Where is our end army? Did we lose every single one of them? Yeah, the end is, yeah, we lost them. The Holy moly. But we need uh, to get ants or the summon because we need to get inside the genes. And he's building yet another end mood. I cannot believe that. Let's kill the end mood first before anything else. We can't. We need to use glorious charge, boys. V3 bit has been taken down. I think we need to build our end own end mood here. Let's do this. Let's build our end own end mood. That's good. There's also one end coming from this area because we can't go inside the base without destroying at least one part of the wall or the gate, and without ends, that's not possible. So let's peel back for now with the Rohirrim Archer army and let's heal up our time. Our uh, heroes can protect the end mood. Let's send them inside the base. We have also healed from the uh, from the spell book in the worst case scenario, which is okay. Someone is killing our ants. Oh, he has fire. That's why. I was actually like, I was, what's going on? You know, why our ants dying so fast? But it's of course because of fire arrow. So now we have healed up. That's beautiful. Now we can group with our Aragorn, Gimli, and Legolas. Um, that's good. Look this ant though. And you guys can do something, maybe. Did he repair the gate? Yeah, he repaired the gate already. 
Just break the break the gate and kill the towers one by one. The, you know the ends are one of the best siege weapons in the game. Also revive tribute. Just you know kill the towers. That's all I'm asking you for. We can ignore Eomir. Eomir needs ages to kill one of the ends. Okay, but one part of the wall has been one part of the wall has been broken or the gate rather. Um, let's summon more ends here. Just to make sure that they are face tanking. King Theorin, use Glorious Charge. Let's go inside the jeans, guys. For death and glory. Let's go. Just focus on the buildings first before anything else. Kill it, Sita. One shot it. Pretty much. Let's use also this ability to stun them and lower their armor bonuses. And by the way, of course, Rohan is the best faction from the heart AI. So when you want to have a big challenge, Rohan is the toughest opening because you can see until that they have infinite money and that they can summon ends all day long, you know? Which is quite annoying to deal with, but also fun at the same time because it's challenging. So we have only two more to go, right? So who we focus on first? I have an idea. I have a surprise for the last one because we have like the explosive mine surprise for the last video. And also I want to have a big surprise for this one. So we have now lots of ends. This one is permanent, so we can use, we can move with them. These are permanent. They're gonna be gone very soon, but it's okay. Now let's buy this piece. Let us move forward. Let us move forward. I mean, money is not a problem at this point. And I'm actually proud of us, guys, because we managed to win this. I mean, I don't want to jinx it because we have not won it yet, but without using the army of the death from the spell one time yet. That's crazy. Normally, it's just too efficient to not use it, you know? What is that? Oh, he was... What is that? Again in smooth, my friends? Can't you not learn anything? Because your ends are getting literally blown up now. Watch this. <laughs> Lol. They get like crazily destroyed in no time. Oh, he's destroying this end mode in the meantime, but it's okay. Uh, Tribute. My, my dude, you guys throw rocks now, okay? You guys throw rocks from a safe distance. And let's go. Let's go. Are I going to buy this farm for now? That's our road. He might build another end mood right there, by the way, but it's okay. I'm not worried about this. I mean, money is not a problem. We don't even need to build farms, but I don't like to have an empty looking base. So actually, for the first time in this game, let's also use Elven, uh, Elven Wood for a change, you know? Hey, King. Here in King, you can use King's Fever. Legolas, you can use Three Archers. Siege slowly but surely. Kill this Elven Warriors, please. Is he building an end mood here? I'm pretty certain he is. A fine hit. A fine hit. Okay, uh, I can also show you that you can kill the Rohan towers with your Rohirrim matches. If you don't know that, watch this. With killing, I mean you can actually blow them up. Let this be their end. Oh, he has heroes. That's why he thinks he can do something about that. Watch Aragorn, please. Oh, but he was almost killing our Theorin. Theorin is also quite tough and tanky when he has the glorious charge. And he's replacing the towers we are killing. That's annoying. This day, we fight. Okay, let's, let's send Aragorn first. Aragorn is tanky. We can make sure that he's face tanking everything. No problem. We have also heal from the spellbook. Let's use the small off breakers. And let's go inside the jeans now. Not, don't lose Aragorn. Very important to keep him alive. He's tanking so much right now, boys. That you can't even believe that. Like, he's tanking so much. So, let's demolish this, because I have a surprise, like mentioned before. Did he build, build Entmut here? Aragorn is taking some damage, but it's okay. Where is Gimli at? Gimli? Oh, Gimli, what you doing, my friend? I'm not, I'm not worried about losing Rohirrim at this point, you know? 
Okay, last opponent, boys. Oh, he's okay. building end mood. <laughs> Lol. Again. Dude. Stop it. I will show you what end moods mean, dude. Trust me on that one. I will show you now what end moods mean. You will see. You will see your, yourself. Maintain your balance. He also summoned ends here, by the way. I believe. Let's go now. Throw I hope not, but I think he did. He did. I think he did. The ring must yeah, he did. Indeed. Rohirrim. But it's okay. This day we fight. This day we fight. They also take damage over time when they are burning like that. Also end, he has also ends coming now from this area. But it's not and it's not the end of the world. I don't mind that. Let's protect our own ends. A fine, A fine hit. He has also three. Uh, that's our tribute. Oh, he killed our tribute. Holy moly. If our ends moot, that's good. Oh, he's breaking the wall. Okay, I mean, and now is the time for us to sacrifice our Rohirrim Arches, boys. Now is the time for us to sacrifice our Rohirrim Arches, I'm telling you. The battle awaits. Just kill this Entmut, ASCP. I don't mind about losing them at this point, you know? I want to just kill this end mood. That's all they gotta do for me. Let's use this. Not that it really matters. The end mood is kind of tanky building, by the way, if you don't know. Aha! We destroyed them. Okay, he's inside the base, but the ends are gonna be gone soon, you know? Okay, we have also end mood here. So now let's let's show him the end power. Oh, here's another. Okay. Let's go. This will be a day to remember. A day to remember. Ah, Gimli, the son of Glorn has been taken down. Actually, we have still two battalions of level ten. Let's try to not lose them at this point. You know, they wanna they deserve they deserve to. Hey. Legolas fight. You wanna fight, bro? You wanna you wanna play rough? Say hello to my little arrows. There we go. I was like, what is damaging my Legolas that much? It was actually the enemy Legolas. I told you guys, Civil War of Rohan. We shall not fall. Alright. This day we fight. Okay guys, go, 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 go. Three bits on the field now, that's dope. Alright. Just get more ants on the field. We have 17 ants queued up. You guys just, you know, destroy one, of, one part of the tower. We need to wait for the permanent ants, you know? They are the ones we can count on. The other ones are like, you know, we borrow them for a bit, but they will be gone sooner. So more ants are required. Oh, here are healing up over time. There is also another end army. Let's break it. Break the gate. Break the wall. Break everything. So these ends are permanent. So we have rights now, including three beards. One, two, three, four ends around this side. But we have also one end who is just chilling when his homeland is being attacked around this side. Ends, they cost only 10 command points, by the way. So we can actually make quite a lot of them. Also from this area. Is Aragorn. Aragorn, the king. Can he deal with that? Three ends against Aragorn. Okay. <laughs> the answer is no, he can't deal with that, boys. He can't. We can't command any more troops. Oh, we can't command any more troops, really? It's okay. We have enough ends, I believe. Uh, just break the wall. Just break the wall. So we can't command any more ants, or com you know, we can't recruit any more ants, but it's okay. 
Okay. So now. Treebeard, some call me. There is much. Number one. Number two. So these are for our ends, boys. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. There is much to do. Does he have Aragorn again? No, he has no Aragorn. So we are just waiting for this end mood to come up and then we are ready to go. Because I want to get as many ends on the field as possible to revenge the feeling of, you know, having to fight against this many ends all game long. Even though we are playing really carefully all the, all the time, we are not trying to destroy the farms. But you can see, even if you do that, you will eventually still be, you know, be forced to, you know, fight against 100 ends at the same time. More ends. Okay, guys, the last march of the ends. Let's go now. Let's go now. Let's go inside the jeans now. Go, Treebeard is leading the ends army, boys. The last march. Come, my friends. The ends are going to war. It is likely. Don't lose Treebeard. He's actually receiving so much damage from something. I don't even know what damages him that much. Look, we have so many ants, they don't even get get control from us. Our are under fine. A fine hit. Just kill everything, every building, everything. Sport from a range too. You guys also sport from a range. Yeah, yeah, look this. <laughs> ends for this, boys. Ends for this. The Lord of the Ring and the end game begins. Let's use Cloud Break to make it shine bright like a diamond. Slap them all, boys. Slap them all. And when one of them dies, oh my god, that's gonna be the time for them to rage, you know? A fine, a fine hit. Rogan matches, you can also try to make it here in time. And yeah. I believe we were just able to be victorious even though we were not summoning the army of the dead from the spellbook one time yet. Which is quite impressive if you ask me. Alright guys, so you all, all of you guys. All of you guys. Throw rocks now. Look how many rocks are being thrown at the same time. Pew, 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 pew. On your face, son. Let's use the Alvin Wood for, uh, for the last time. There we go. And we are victorious just like that. I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. We did it with Gonzo. We did it with Isengard and Mordor. And of course, the last but not least was the Rohan faction in the Civil War against Seven Heart Armies. And you can see we have killed a lot of units. We have killed over 2,400 units in total. We have destroyed over 100 buildings. We have lost only 29, even though if I would be playing a bit more carefully, we would not lose this many. Uh, but again, we were forced to deal with end moods all the time. I believe we did a good job. We have only lost 200 units, but I think it's okay. Uh, it was kind of tough, but it was fun at the same time. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe if you are interested in more Battle for Middle Earth related content in the future. And yeah, I will see you next time. Until then, guys, take care of yourselves. As always, keep hitting like a track and also stay beyond standards. Peace out.